Well, we decided to head out to St. Joe despite it raining all day the day before. We had about a 20-30% rain chance this morning. We figured we'd give it a shot. And luckily, it dried up about noon. But this morning, the, walks, the, the rocks were wet. The ground was wet. Had some trouble later on with a KTM 350 that still had some stock tires on it, the uh, K, uh, TKC 80s. And I actually had a little bit of trouble with the tires that up to this point I had been really impressed with. They were the Moto Z Mountain Hybrid on the rear, and I really like them in dry conditions, but I'm really not too impressed with the wet. I think I'd almost rather go back with the uh, Tusk D Sport for a, a wet, rocky situation like this. Be our guide, great one. <laughs> Yeah, three three fifty like that. Yeah. Well, he's going down two hundred all the way. He's meeting us up. Yeah. 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 So after about a ten minute break, after a fifteen minute pull everybody up the muddy hill, we decided to head back out, hook up with one of the guys that had parked at the wrong parking lot, and uh, finally caught up with him and got in some of the fun, free-flowing sand portion of St. Joe and then right back into the woods. Hey, Mike. Mike, you want cops? Now let's talk about bags. You'll notice here on my handlebars, I have got the Giant Loop handlebar bag. And I went ahead and I purchased, in addition, the Giant Loop um, fender bag, which could also be a, a tail bag, which you'll actually see is on the back of my bag here. Now I've never owned anything from Giant Loop. I always thought they looked quite truthfully horrible. I never liked their design concept. But man, I am loving these two bags. Two things, first off. Uh, on the fender bag, I have lost... Uh, at least one Tusk fender bag, and I've had two of them have the zippers rip out. Um, I have to now strap them down with extra bungee cords just to keep them on because even though I've notched out parts of my fender, they're just, they're just not good quality bags. They come off, the attachments are bad, the stitching comes loose. Um, this fender bag is just absolutely phenomenal from Giant Loop. Uh, the bungee system they have with it is fantastic. The fact that it's waterproof is fantastic. I'm loving it. But I've got all my, my, my tire stuff in that one, right? But this little pouch actually carries pretty much every single one of my trail tools in here. And I am just really impressed with the way it's held up, the way it's attached, and the fact that I can throw it on there and it doesn't interrupt or interfere with any of my controls and stays put. <laughs> Mother bird! Woo! Sorry, guys. <laughs>
the, fir the first one, I think I just hit a rock sideways or something and tossed me down. The second one, I got caught on a branch, caught my strap. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Well, holy bejeebus, man. I think we were pretty much mostly all getting tired, except for Kevin, of course. Kevin, he's this weirdo that just, like, keeps gaining more energy the more he works. Kevin. Mine just starts depleting, and downhill it goes. I have yet had a day that I've been able to make it past about two o'clock without feeling just butt tired. I think I did three o'clock last weekend, but man, I, I need to get my ass in shape. Maybe do some yoga here with Parmander. You got it, Parmander. It's that metal pipe that got you, buddy. Well, it was time to head on back towards the uh, trailer, so we popped on, I think, trail 360, maybe uh, 310, maybe 410. I don't know. I get so confused with all these trail numbers. Headed on back. On the way through, um, on the way back there, we actually ran across a couple hills here you're going to be seeing in a bit. Uh, only one of us was brave enough to attempt the second one. Um, man, <laughs> I tried walking it last week. I got about a third of the way up, and I just kept sliding down. I, I just couldn't even walk it up. So even though it doesn't look like much for this little two-stroke, it, it was a beast. Well, thanks for chilling with me again. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification. If not, see you on the flip side.